welcome to LSU Edge or Club Edge as they call it here in the football operations building. This is the nutrition area for the LSU football team and I'm joined with Lauren Reagan, the director of sports nutrition here at LSU. And Lauren, I know this is your first year with the Tigers. Welcome to Baton Rouge. Thank you. I know you're still getting used to your new digs, but do you have a minute to show me around? Absolutely. Let's see the fueling station. So like she said, this is what we call Club Edge. It's a really convenient location for our athletes and for the football team. Right out here is where they lift and then they come in afterwards. They can fuel their bodies with what they need. So if you kind of look around here, right here we've got some vitamins for them and just a multivitamin, a D3, a B12. And so then we kind of come in here and you can see that where we make their smoothies. What are some of the ways that you educate the players on healthy nutrition even when you're not around and how they can maintain that throughout the especially the busy season you know I think just teach them, teaching them convenient ways they're not just athletes right. or student athletes and so teaching them convenient ways to take things on the go how to utilize our fueling stations and then how to go to the grocery store we'll do grocery store tours with them um, so they know what to do when we're not around and then we'll kind of have grocery lists for them a lot of different ways we do a lot of one-on-one -on -one consults but really for these athletes they're they're on the go all the time. Great. They don't have time to sit down with you and just chit chat all the time. And so really being in the fueling station, being at training table, being at practice mm -hmm. or a lift is huge. And they'll just run up, ask a quick question, we'll answer, and then they'll go about their way. So kind of the quick education for them. They don't have a lot of time for the long answers, but <laughs> that's the most convenient way for them. One of the things I was impressed with is the training table meal, the meal that the team eats weekly in the stadium. What's the purpose of that? You know, training table is really a good time for us to tailor a meal towards their performance needs. Yes, it's for performance and we want it to be a clean meal, but at the same time we want to we want to be relaxed with it as well. So some days they're going to get their fried shrimp and their fried <laughs> chicken and their cookies and dessert, but for the most part it's a meal where they can go in and they know they're fueling their bodies. That's going to help them on the field. And so being present there and being able to train them and teach them um, how to eat there Great. helps them whenever they're out at a restaurant or cooking their own meals. Mm -hmm. And so we really, really utilize that as an educational tool. It's not just a meal. Um, it really benefits them beyond just feeding them at that point in time. Now your area right here in the weight room at Football Ops is very close, right next door to strength and conditioning mm -hmm. coach Tommy Moffat. Yeah. What's your working relationship like with him? with you all dealing with similar things? You know, it's really great um, with the strength staff and the training staff and the coaches and the nutrition. Everyone kind of works together. We're always wanting to get across the same mes message to each individual athlete. So if they're hearing the same thing from all of the coaches and all of the support yeah. staff, then they're a lot more successful. So we're constantly in communication with each other. We bounce ideas uh, off of each other with meals and snacks and, you know, to-go meals that the guys may be grabbing. And so that's all always good to just get their input as well. The strength staff is wonderful and they're mm -hmm. they're really knowledgeable on nutrition as well. And then same with the training staff. We're in just as close communication yeah. and so whenever we can, you know, all be on the same page and be giving the same message, it really goes goes pretty far for each athlete. Now one of the things that I know is very popular around here are the smoothies. I'm always yeah. seeing people walking around with the smoothie containers. Can you uh, bring me over here and maybe Absolutely. make one of the favorite smoothies of this? Which would be one of the favorite smoothies? The favorite smoothie is actually going to be the chocolate Moffat named after Coach Moffat. And so it's a good one for our athletes. They love it. It's actually one of the ones we have more for weight gain. So it's going to be a little higher in calorie. Great for recovery. <laughs> Frosty, kind it of is sorta. just like a dessert. Okay. Again, sorry guys, I get to have all the fun and have the drinks of the tailgating, but I'll throw it back to y'all at the stadium.